I guess, I mean, the obvious question, how'd you, how'd you end up here at Pitt? Uh, yeah, you know, when the uh, regular season was over at the University of Florida, you know, I was talking a lot with my family and, you know, realizing, you know, where I want to be is that next level and where can I get and what I have to do to get there. And, you know, at that time, you know, I was splitting time with the other tight end, tremendous athlete, Kyle Pitts uh, from uh, Philadelphia. So, you know, that's when I knew, you know, I could either stay there another year, or year, you know, split time with him or I could go somewhere else and, you know, get, get a starting job and, you know, really, you know, put my talents to better use so how, how soon did you hear from Pitt after you decided to first day it? I mean they they're the first they're the first guy, team to call an offer me um, yeah, so they were on me uh, right away right when my name hit the, the portal they, they called me instantly so I, I, assume, I assume a guy with a, a tar big target like you probably had other schools looking at you how did you decide who did you who else was trying to yeah, I mean, it was, I mean, it was a plethora of schools, and at the end of the day, I, I had my idea of what I wanted and what I needed, and so, you know, I had my list of check, you know, the check boxes through and pay, you know, check them all off, you know, they graduated two uh, seniors from this position, you know, they needed help in this position, and so I knew, you know, and they use this position a lot, especially in this offense with Coach Whipple, I mean, it's a, it's a great foundation, a great team to be a part of, I mean, I just can't wait to get out there and get started with them. Lucas, did you know Kylan Johnson at all? Did he yeah. tell you anything about here that helped your decision? Yeah, a lot. You know, Kylan, you know, is actually one of my close friends from Florida, and so you know, we talked a lot. You know, I was on the phone with them every other day when getting recruited from here, just hearing how it was for him, how they took care of him, and this and that. And you know, he gave me nothing but uh, great, great things about uh, University of Pittsburgh, and it's, it's held true since I've been here. So, guys, we also have freshman linebacker AJ Roberts over on the other back row. When you're looking to uh, be graduate transfer, you know, you only get one year where you're going. Do you look at what that school has done with other guys that came there in that position and what kind of opportunity they gave them? Um, a little bit. I mean, there's a lot to that, you know, with the, you know, older tight ends that had been here in the past. You know, it's different, you know, office coordinators and this and that. So you got to kind of got to look at a lot of different things, you know, with Coach Whipple. He's had a handful of guys, you know, Jimmy Graham, you know, um, Adam Brenneman. So he's had a handful of tight ends be extremely successful through his, you know, offense. So that was one of the things that I noticed and how, you know, he uses the tight ends. So. But they didn't, you know, obviously the tight ends didn't produce a lot here last year. So how did they kind of sell you on the role of the tight end in this offense, what they want out of the tight end in this offense? Hmm. Uh, that's a good question. Um, I mean, if you look at it, you know, they, they targeted the tight end quite a bit. It's just you got to be able to make those plays and um, do what you can when you get the ball in your hand. So um, just something I know I can bring to this team is, you know, getting the ball, with, you know, getting the ball in space. You know, I can do a lot of things with it. So that's something, you know, I bring to the table, just that ball skill. So. I think that's something that's going to help um, give trust to the quarterbacks to use the tight end. So I understand you struck up a friendship with the starting quarterback already. Have you guys been working, doing some work on the field already? Oh yeah, we already had it. We had it before this today. Um, did a little routes and yeah, I know Kenny's a great guy. He's one of my close friends here now, and you know, hang out with him a lot and getting to know him and everyone else on the team. So it's been uh, it's been great. He said he hosted you right on my visit. Yeah. yeah. What was that like? And just kind of getting. Oh, it's great. Um, his friend group is just like, you know, the one I had at Florida. So, you know, it clicked really uh, easily. And, you know, they're just great guys. I mean, they just come in, you know, they're they're not selfish. You know, they you know, they want to get you involved with everything. You know, they, they treat you like you've been here before. So it was like, you know, come on this visit, you know, and they made you feel at home. And, and that was something I noticed, too, was just the guys here is, you know, there's a lot of unselfish guys here that, you know, they want everyone to continue to get better and, and uh, push each other. So. Did you make any promises like the tight end is going to be a big part of our offense? Well, that's a, that's why I'm here. That's the plan. So, yes, sir. Anything else?